I have to make this review by Mother's Day weekend so you guys know not to take your mom to this movie. Mother's Day is the third holiday film from director Gary Marshall, who in the past did Valentine's Day and New Year's Eve. In the film, we follow stories of four different groups of people on Mother's Day, and their stories all intertwine at one point or another, and yeah, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's literally the entire movie. Now, I'm pretty split with Gary Marshall's movies. On one hand, I do enjoy Valentine's Day. On the other, though, I really do not like New Year's Eve. And the trailers for this looked extremely bad, but I still wanted to enjoy it. Well, of course I couldn't because that is just my life. Mother's Day is one of the worst films, let alone one of the worst comedies this year. I only laughed out loud one time in this entire hour and 50 minute movie. But what about the cast? It's kind of solid, right? You know, everyone in here is doing it just for the paycheck. Jennifer Aniston, doing it just for the paycheck. Kate Hudson, doing it just for the paycheck. And I was falling asleep in her side plot. And Julia Roberts, that freaking hairpiece. Oh my god. It looks so bad. Only people that did remotely half a decent job in the movie is Jason Sudeikis, Britt Robertson, and whoever played Britt Wa Robertson's husband in the movie. For the horrendous screenplay they had to work with, they tried to make it at least somewhat good. Besides that though, there's really not anything that works in the movie. Gary Marshall lets every scene drag on for like an extra 20 minutes, which makes the film feel very repetitive and just annoying and boring. And this movie did not have to be an hour and 50 minutes is what I'm saying. Oh my, it, like, it honestly could have been, like, freaking an hour and 20 minutes. Like, I know it's a long stretch, but damn. But in all seriousness, though, this guy is really weird with the way he directs certain scenes. Like, there's a scene where Jason Sudeikis is lying on the ground, and everyone's looking at him. In the background, there's playing rap music. Then they cut to a shot of everyone looking at him, and in the left corner, it's just this little black kid just, like, freaking dancing to the music, and it's like, what the f Wow, what? And pretty much overall, some of my thoughts on this movie, one of Jennifer Aniston's kids has a backpack with the movie theme of The Nut Job. The Nut Job. The Nut Job. So overall, Mother's Day is a terrible time at the movies, and definitely do not take your mom to see this, or she will most likely disown you. With all that said, I'm gonna give Mother's Day a D. Thank you all so much for watching, and guys, I've seen Green Room, Keanu, I Am The Sky, The Boss, and I'm gonna write reviews of those, and I'm gonna try to film them eventually, I'm gonna try to get them up soon, so just be on the lookout for those reviews, and, uh, yeah, so until my next one, whichever it is, I'm Random Mr. 401, and I will see you all later. <laughs>